Today's video is sponsored by the Ridge Wallet. My name is Jordan, and today I am back out where it all began. One of my favorite spots to do some treasure hunting. So if you guys have been watching any of my videos from back in the day, you know exactly where I'm at. But I'm not going to tell you because this spot is super cool and super exciting. Always something cool to find here. We found everything from genuine Civil War relics to modern treasures to cell phones, trash, guns, and uh, even an ambulance stretcher once, which is really weird. But still, uh, so we're going to dive this spot again. It's been a long time since we've been here, so hopefully... Uh, we could find something. I got Sirius Nick with me as always. Super serious, super focused. Hopefully he finds some treasure too. Let's quit talking. Let's get down in the water, see what we can find. Before we get the water, let me tell you about today's sponsor, which is Ridge Wallet. Ridge Wallet hit me up online, asked me if I'd like to try out one of their wallets. And uh, since I don't really have a preference on wallets, so I don't know what a good wallet is, I say, what the heck? So they sent me one. And uh, I gotta tell you, I really like it. Let me show you this thing. Main reasons I like this wallet is because it's super light, super convenient, and uh, it, it's, it's very organized. You know, you press this side, one side is my ID, the other side is my most used credit card, and you got a little money clip on the outside. And that's it. And it's very has like a security barrier, so nobody can really steal your credit card information by rubbing up against it, like you've seen with those magnetic strips or whatnot. I would not steer you guys in a direction of a cheap product. So let me tell you right now that Ridge Wallet is a great product. Not the cheapest product, but it is well worth the money. So by all means, go to the link in the description down below. Go see if they have something you might like, and you'll get a big fat discount if you use my code by clicking on that link right down below. I got Serious Nick with me today, and I have an extra Ridge Wallet that Ridge Wallet sent me. So let's go surprise him with a new wallet. Oh, Nicholas. Yes, sir. Serious Nick, back in the game. So, uh... You got a wallet? Yeah. Show everybody your wallet. Let's get a nice close look at this wallet. Nice and thick. Man, that's a that's a janky, unorganized wallet. Yeah. What do you think about that wallet? Does it hurt your back? I don't put it in my pocket. That's because it hurts your back. Right. Well, Ridge Wallet sponsored this video, and they actually sent me one to give away to somebody <laughs> that I thought is deserving. And since your wallet is so unorganized, now you have a Ridge Wallet and all to yourself. It's carbon fiber. Real carbon fiber. And it's uh it's thief proof. So nobody can rub upon you and steal your 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 stuff with no a magnetic way, really? Yeah. Let's open it up and let's have a look. Let's see if it's really thief proof. <clears throat> Ridge. Pretty fancy packaging too. Right? Like if you can get the box open. I think it's tape. Is it tape shut? No, it's not. Oh, it's okay. like, a, like a glove. It's like the uh, Apple iPhone, right? When you open the box, it has to make a sound. <sighs> you burp it, it's still fresh. Those mm. are fancy looking. Man, you got a sticker. What? That'll actually make my Jeep go faster. It will. Yeah. That's carbon fiber to make it lighter. Yep. <laughs> Heck yeah, man. That is awesome. <clears throat> Even fancy. Fancy is. Oh, 
do it in the book. My bad. <laughs> yeah, there's one more up there too. <laughs> Watch for the bubbles, got it. That's what got me, the bubbles. Start at a walk getters. It gets you. Hilarious. I was like, if I have a heart attack today, that'd be great. Um, uh, this close, dude, this close. Because I saw the bubbles and I was like, what in the world is under here? It's a big old turtle. <laughs> I was like, we have sea turtles now. <laughs> yeah, they migrated. Yeah. Okay, we are out of the water. Let's go check out what Nick found first. Nicholas? Yes, sir. What'd you find, Nicholas? Uh, some brass. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, modern crap. 
Mm -hmm. Apparently there's somebody out there fishing for sharks. Yeah, big wibbles. Yeah. But you got yourself a murder weapon. Mm -hmm. Oh man. Yeah, it's not too bad of a find. You got some money, you know, maybe go to the oh. store, get some get something to eat, you yeah. know. <laughs> now let's check out my finds of the day. We start off right here. We found like three vape pins, a big old swollen cell phone battery, whole bunch of golf balls, a few fishing lures, a peony. There's quarters somewhere. I don't know where it went. And I found this headlamp. I wonder if it could be fixed. I doubt it. Been down there a while. And the finds of the day, obviously. Found that very old 22 rifle. Been in there a long time, long time. No numbers or anything on it. But over here got ourselves a really nice nine millimeter it says cpx2 uh i think it's let me see here it's over there s c c y i don't know what that is to be honest with you then over here we got a big clip and i think it says smith and wesson on it 25 rounds doesn't seem like it's been down there that long i wonder where the gun's at Hello, um, I'm wondering if you could send a police officer out to Harden Bridge boat ramp. What kind of report do you need? Uh, we was out scuba diving in the river again and uh, found a pistol. Okay, I'll get you an officer. Cool, appreciate it. Alright, thank you. Bye-bye. Anyway. How you doing? Good, how about yourself? Oh, pretty good. I found some more stuff for you. Yeah, there might be one in the chamber. I don't, I don't know, but I couldn't get that to slide either. For giggles, I found that, but I usually don't call you for shit like that. Just because it's been down there for so long. It, it was a 22. Now it's nothing. <laughs> uh, I'm do it nah, I figured. All right. Uh, you need anything else for me? No, I appreciate it. All right. Yeah, man. You have a good day. Well, there you have it. The cops came and took the gun. There might be a serial number on it. I couldn't find it. I, it, I think it's on the back near the hammer, but I'm sure he's going to be able to figure it out. Um, I usually wouldn't call the cops, but that gun was newer, so I figured I'd turn it over to them. I'm not going to do anything with it, so maybe they can link it to a crime, solve some cases. Who knows? But that's going to do it for today's adventure. I'm so glad you guys joined me. Make sure you subscribe to this channel so you don't miss any of my future adventures. And until we meet again, my name is Jeremy, and I will see you on that next adventure. Woo!